Alrighty, I'm back again after a month or two hiatus, but I <clears throat> am going to be doing a large video this time to celebrate Detective Pikachu coming out. I've got this, and I've also got this. That's not all. That's not all. I've also got one of these and uh, one of these and I've also got one of these. So I spent a disgusting amount of money on this because um, I'm just extremely hyped. So I'm going to be opening all of these in one go. Okay, so first up, we're going to be opening this. So this is very interestingly uh, packaged. So it's kind of packaged just like a little folder, which is very neat. You got your uh, Detective Pikachu, Sun and Moon number... 194? Yeah. Basically what comes in this is like a little promo card, a metallic coin, two uh, Detective Pikachu packs, and one TCG pack. There's also a little code card in here for you guys. So because of how weirdly this is packaged, it's gonna... I don't know how to open this properly. Ah, bucket. I'm just... Yeah. Just, uh, just do this shit. That works. That works well enough. Gets me the cards I need. Oh, fuck, I'm bending. I'm bending them. Okay. So, while the packaging is creative, it's uh, a little annoying. Not, not exactly the best. Alright, so right now we've got this little Detective Pikachu. My camera will f Oh, there we go. Yep, Sun and Moon 90, uh, 194. A lot of stuff in Sun and Moon. Brilliant deduction. Thank you. Um, so we've got this code card. And we've got this cute little advertisement for the shop. It's got a bunch of Neat stuff. Some berry juice. Alright, so then we'll just open up the packs for these. So there's only about four additional game cards in here, which kind of sucks, but... Uh, you know, I think it's kind of like the, uh, the uh, Japanese cards, basically. So, right off the bat, we've got... Ugly little duckling... Just panicking right there. We've got a cool Charmander. Fuck my camera. There we go. Got a Bulbasaur. And we've got a Charizard at the end. And here is the code card. You know what? We'll open up the Crimson Invasion pack that comes with it first. Before we get into the last part. I'm not incompetent, I just, ooh! Okay, so we've spoiled the fact that it's going to be a hollow or better. But that's alright. Two, three to the front. I believe the Sun and Moon, we removed the back. Alright, so what we've got here is a counter catcher. Saravia. Grumpig. Execute. Jigglypuff. Chimeco, Spoink, Swablu, a uh, hollow, uh, reverse hollow, Ghastly, and we've got an Alolan Raichu as our hollow. Ugh. Okay, so we've got a, a second Psyduck. Ooh, Magikarp. It looks grotesque, but, uh, that's fine. 
Charmander, and we've got a Ditto. That's neat. I can copy anything with this. Okay. So I got a I spent way too much on these. Um, I'll be honest, I didn't know that there was only four cards in the pack, so I was like, oh, okay, this is fine. Uh, I spent like, oh man. All right, so in this one, we've got two packs again, and we've got Burning Shadows, and Burning Shadows is a set that I really like because um, there's a chance to get the Rainbow Holographic uh, Charizard. Is this the same? Same detective? Yes, it is. So that's that kind of sucks. In this one, I believe the only difference between this and that pack is a uh, $2 difference, and you get like a neat little binder to collect all 18. I don't know if there's any secret rares or anything in this set, though. Ugh. Okay, so. Right here, got this little binder. This is Detective Pikachu on it, and we can fit. Now, my math it ain't too great, but uh, I believe 18 cards can fit in this, plus, like, whatever secret rares there might be in this set. I don't know if they would do secret rares for such an, such an odd uh, little movie promotion pack set, whatever. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna open them up. I'm gonna put the Detective Pikachu stuff on the side. Open up the regular packs, and then at the very end of opening everything, I will start just opening up Detective Pikachu packs. Code card right there for you guys. One, two, three. Electric. Electric Pikachu. We've got Sophocles, Escape Rope, Rotom Dex, Duskull, Ah, Dish Munbury, Sock, and Blow. Uh, Horsey, and we've got uh, Lolan Raticate, and I've got way too many of these. No, I will not destroy you. I don't think I showed off the pen from the, la the little, little little coin from the last one. It's got a nice little holographic design, but uh, it's kind of kind of odd. I wish they made like a Ryan Reynolds one instead. Like I'll be honest. Ugh. All right. So right now we've got two packs just waiting for us to open them up. Now I don't. Should I open them? No. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go with uh. I'm going to go with opening this up. <sighs> so a nice little lunch box. Nice little thing to store your lunch. Or your school supplies if you're still in school. Or your lunch if you're still in school. Really, yeah, this just uh, operates really well as a lunch box. Got a bunch of cute little... Pikachu's, so I feel like this might be a render of the, like the uh, the uh, movie, and not like regular anime Pikachu that we're used to, because you can see little bits of like, like you can tell it's like tufts of fur on there, which is neat. Got a little graffiti uh, Pikachu right there. There we go. Get that out of here. Ooh. So this comes with a cute little pin, little Pikachu ears, and like the Detective Pikachu hat. So that's that's cute. That's cool. I'm gonna put this on my sweet Naruto hat. <laughs> Sorry about that. Let's ignore that. So they made another uh, uh, of these coins. 
really wish they had like variety, a little more variety with this stuff. Um, maybe uh, a Psyduck coin or an Apom coin or like Eevee or something. Actually, an Eevee coin would have been nice because they were trying to do the whole Pikachu Eevee thing. All right, there's a lot of packs in this. So we've got Guardians Rising and Crimson Invasion. We'll be opening up those ones, and we've got like seven packs right here. So we've got nine packs to open up later for the for that. And before we open up those, what we have is a little notepad to take down your clues, uh, evidence, and whatnot. Because, you know, you're a detective and you're a Pikachu. Then we got cute little decal stickers that I will probably put on my Switch, honestly. Put this little little green one on there. Alright. Now that we've got this, we can just shovel all these fucking cards in there to keep everything a little organized during this. Yep, put them in here and I will just look at them later. Guardians Rising. I don't think there's anything in here that I really cared about. Hmm. One, two, three. And since it's sun and moon, take that off. Got Beware. Bro uh, Slagu. Cottony. Carvana, Patrat, little, little Gothita, uh, uh, little Titty Monster, got Lampant, and we've got Salazzle. Hot Poison. Alright, and for the next one we've got Crimson Invasion. I think there's like a Rainbow Gyarados that I really want. In this set, I've already got one. It's just like I'd like to have another one. Because rainbow cards are freaking cool. That's the coat card. One, two, three to the front. Fairy energy. So we've got our counter energy our fighting memory, counter catcher, Starly, Salandit, Shelmet. Yang Mo O or Jeng Mo O, Hang Mo O, Star You, Reverse Magikarp, and a Hollow Gengar. That ain't too bad. Ain't too ain't too bad. Nothing crazy yet. We might see some crazy stuff in there. Hopefully, hopefully we, there's like full arts or something because full arts would be pretty pretty neato for that set. All right, now we're moving on to the. Uh, <clears throat> Almost a veiny, but no, a really scaly, super detailed Charizard GX uh, uh, little thing. It's really neat how these like open up and shit. And you can see like you get your standard giant card, and then you got your regular small ready to play card. All right, now we're <clears throat> just gonna open this like so. Actually, I'm gonna move this because this is. Getting in the way. It was a decent idea to like store these bad boys, but I, I, ain't, I ain't feeling it. Okay. So far, I'm honestly, I'm really liking this pin. Like, this pin is really good. Okay. I wish they didn't package these like this. Oh, wait. Wait. Oh, wow! Oh, Alright, so that's, that ain't too bad. Um, so we've got this lovely boy. Dreadful Flames, Steam Ar Artillery, Raging Destruction. These names, these names for these moves kind of suck. They feel like movie, movie power-up names. I guess that makes sense. Alright. Oh, we've got this giant. Oh, there's a bunch of shit on the back. I don't, I don't, I don't know if I like that. That kind of devalues the card a little bit, but it's got a nice, nice feel, nice texture to the uh, 
to the card. Nice smooth little, little deal. You will watch over us and bless me. Got ooh, got four movie packs. I believe for getting a ticket at the theater, you do get like at the theater. You do get like a uh Oh god, I just had like a stroke, I think. Uh you do get like a little movie pack though, I believe. I don't know if all theaters are gonna be doing that though. Oh, theaters. For your filming pleasure. Psychic Memory, Mobile, Grabbler, or Fish Ghastly, A.A. Ron, Dominoes, Staryu, Nummel, and we've got Cacturn. Ooh, why the... <sighs> Come on, I just want a good boy, because I... I really don't know if they've got like any good stuff for like and and it's green. <sighs> I don't know if they've got any like super decent stuff when it comes to uh the the Detective Pikachu packs. Ooh, we got a watch hog, Gaily, Machoke, Cottony, Bell Sprout. Gligar, Alolan Geodude, Petrat, Stuffle, and we've got Trevin and Fuck. Alright, now for the big mama, the, the the main course, the good the good meal, the Mewtwo, the Mewtwo GX box. It's pretty much the same as the Charizard one, but uh it's very anticipated because Mewtwo is like kind of like Charizard. He's the poster boy for uh, Gen One. Mewtwo is kind of just like ooh, he's the poster man, poster lord. Just not give a fuck. Just not give a fuck. Come on, talk to me. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. That's a little code card ring, guys. This is a little code card. Ooh. Yeah, so we got a little telekinesis going on. Raining pulse and the Psychic Nova GX. It's pretty good. You know. You know what? I like this one a little more than I like the Charizard card, mostly because it doesn't have shit on the back. So I think I'm gonna, yeah, Sun and Moon nine, uh, 196. You'll watch us. You'll you'll bless our cards. Maybe we'll have better luck with you. Adding four to the pile. This is this is what our Sun and Moon cards are looking like. Not Sun and Moon. Uh, fuck, whatever it was. So we've got our Burning Shadows pack. I might just open up like a base base pack. Ooh. That's our code card. One, two, three. Leaf is no longer here. Hypno, Pokeball, Pelipper, Togedemaru, Togedemaru, Poplio, Zubat, Carvana, uh, Snubble, Reverse Skarmory, and a Gold Duck. Ironically, not gold. Not even the shiny, which is kind of disappointing. Like, you'd think since shiny Psyduck is blue, uh, shiny Gold Duck would be Gold. <laughs> Shit. Uh oh. Ah. Mm. Yeah. Whoops. Oh. Ooh. Um. 
So all right, so there's the uh, there's the code card. Ooh, we got something good. I saw like the border of it because I don't know how to open these like a pro. I ain't Max Mofo here. Um, so we've got Sophocles, Survivor. You know, what, let's just fuck these guys. <laughs> and Gardevoir GX. That's that's great. Fucking finally, we have we have one one really good pull from our standard packs. Thank the Lord. Thanks, Mewtwo. You're a good one. You're a good. You're a good Pokemon. All right, so for the for the main course, the actual main course, uh, we've got all of these to get into. So I ain't gonna waste any time. No more time being wasted. Ugh. Psyduck. Charmander. Bulbasaur. Ooh, Arcanine. That's that's a that's a new one. Finally. And that's the code card. <laughs> Fuck! Uh, we got Lick of Tongue, Jigglypuff, Magikarp, and we got a second Arcanine. Alright, if we open one more Arcanine, I'm gonna keep that, but uh, our fourth Arcanine I have to, uh, have to toss, have to carve up or rip apart or something. Just to uh, show the pack gods. That I ain't playing around. That I deserve. That I deserve more. That I'm an ungrateful little piece of shit. Ooh, Mewtwo. Twelve out of eighteen. Nice. Okay. All right. Okay. Got got a got a good pull. That that the pack gods are listening. They they know I ain't goofing around. I ain't joking. Bitch. <laughs> More lol? I'm so I'm honestly I'm very glad that they aren't like just sticking to a uh, ooh, Ludicolo. Oh, they aren't just sticking to like um Gen 1 uh Pokémon and really milking that. They're really trying to like please every uh, generation. Especially with like how Greninja like popped up in that uh, trailer, like, holy shit, that guy's cool, and then there's, like, uh, stuff talking about Sinnoh, so I guess the Sinnoh region exists in this universe, as well as, like, every other, uh, oh, speaking of Greninja, um, wow, and there's the code card, but yeah, I'm really glad that they're actually talking about other regions and really just not sticking to Gen 1. Well, lovely. Um, and is that a is that a different Charizard from the one that I got? I, I don't even have that around right now. It's in the box. Why is he crying? Is that a deer? I don't, I don't know. He's got a wild tackle, which is crazy, but it does a lot of damage to itself. And then we've got that code. Oh, fuck, this is gonna be a bitch to upload. Alright, so we've got our Charmander, our Bulbasaur, our Lick of Tongue. Getting a lot of doubles. Oh! Third Arcanine. Third Arcanine, so you know. You know, guys. I'm a man of my word. <laughs> Please don't be a third Arcanine. It's a, it's a second Greninja. And that's the code card. <sighs> Ooh, that's bent up there. That's, that's, that's not good. Ooh, slacking. New boy. It's very, very hairy. Very, he's like my stepdad, a very hairy individual.
Oh, come on. Okay. I don't want to fuck up and end up having, like, loose packs. I gotta keep these close together. Not buried under the mess of uh, cardboard and plastic. Me rip card. Bulbador. Uh, fucking. <coughs> There's my stepdad, a very veiny individual. He's directing traffic. You could, like. You ever think about how Machamp can, like have twice the dabbing power of a normal person. I guess that's just Pokemon for you, though. Oh, what the fuck do you have here? Here's a second slacking. He's got... Pitch. That's... That's wild. That's a lot. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how many... I don't know how many uh, Pokemon could withstand a move that is 150 uh, damage. Okay, I think we're I think we're we're done now. Uh, uh oh. Yeah, we're getting a lot of doubles now. That's a shame. That is. That's a big shame. Well, now I now I feel bad for spending fucking a hundred dollars on all these fucking packs and sets. Oh wow! I'll just give you the code card automatically. That Mewtwo again. That's nice. Oh, come on. Give me something that isn't... Ooh! Detective Pikachu! I don't have that one yet. 10 of 18. And here's the last pack. If anything's gonna wow us, it, I hope it's this. And if it's nothing, I've got like two packs that I can open up. Just, just to... Just to open them. And it's nothing. I got a lot of my champs. I'll spare you. Alright, so since it didn't quite wow me, I've got these two that we can open up right now. Sun and Moon base set. Feels like there's a lot more... After opening like a bunch of packs that only have four cards in them, this feels hefty. This feels like a hefty boy. I am also a hefty boy. I eat two meals a day. Pukamuku, Switch, Hypno, Frog and Roller, Marini, Crub Roller. Got Mr. Burns in in the <coughs> in the pack. Ugh. Come on. Fuck, okay, so we know. We know it's a Bruxish little paintbrush Pokemon. I, I only think that because it's really colorful and it sounds like brush. Brush six brush. Bleh. Grubin. Dave Grubin. Alright, well that's 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 it. i I guess I'll see you guys in another month. Um I do have a couple things that I wanna like open up. So I've got these uh Thick Japanese packs. I've got like ten of them. Five from this set and five from this set. And I want to open those up at some point. It's just like with how life is right now. Uh, I don't really have the time to do anything like that. And I've, I've been sitting on that. I've been sitting on that for like a good four months or so now. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, been in, it's been in the uh, do later list for a bit. Um, I'm gonna, this is, this is, this is bad. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get back into the swing of things, though, at some point. Uh, thanks for watching the video, remember to like, comment, and subscribe.